Hey everybody, I'm here today to do a tutorial on my Disney paper clips that I have in my traveler's notebook. So I'm in Design Space and I uploaded a couple of images, but we're going to go in and upload a few more. So I want to grab Mickey and I want to grab his hands and I want to grab his shoe and his pants. So there's his shoe, and there's his pants. Okay, we're going to insert those images. I'm going to move these to the side because we'll use them in a little bit. Right now, we're going to work on these guys. Now, I have three set three paper clips. The jumbo, which is four inches by about an inch. The medium size, that is five eighths by two inches and then the small size that is five eighths by about a one and a quarter inch. The ones that I make first will fit the medium and the small clips and that will be these six images. Now these images I like them to be probably about an inch and a half wide to about two inches tall give or take. So I'm gonna just change these up right now. So we'll start with an inch and a half. Okay. And it's a little over two, but that will be fine. Let's go to Donald. We'll do 1.50, which is an inch and a half, by two. That looks good to me. And then we'll go to Mini. We'll do the same thing. Um, 1.50. She looks a little small, so I might change her up to 1.75. Yeah, that looks a little better to me, because it's just about the same. All right. Let's see what Daisy looks like at 1.50. Uh, she's a little bit more than two, but um, she looks pretty good. Let's change Mickey to 1.50. Uh, he could be a little bit bigger, so let's see what 1.75 looks like. All right, that looks good to me. And let's see what Pluto looks like. 1.50. Um, I like him to be a little bit bigger, so we'll go 1.75. All right, those six look good to me. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab them, and I'm going to edit, copy, edit, paste, and then while the blue line is still around them, I'm going to drag them down. And I'm going to come up here to flip, and I want to flip just one set of them horizontally. And I'll explain to you why. So now I'm just going to move them around so that they're in pairs. And I kind of like them facing one another. That's just me. I'm a little goofy. Ha, ha, ha. Pun on goof. Um, there's Mick. I'll move him up. Come in with Pluto. I'm going to actually just minimize my screen just a little so that everything can be seen. And there'll be Minnie and Daisy. Okay. So now these six are good. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to group them in pairs and I'm going to flatten them. Whoops, didn't mean to do that. Group her and I'm going to flatten. I'll move them down so that they're not in my way. And I'll come grab Pluto and I'm going to flatten him. By flattening them, they become print and then cuts. I don't have to cut each piece out individually. And we'll flatten Donald. And we'll flatten Goof. Alright, so this set of six are ready to be, be cut. Now we're gonna work on um gonna work on these four. Alright, these four drive me a little crazy because they're non-traditional colors. So I'll start with the hand. The hand should be, for me, should be black and white. So I'm just going to change them to black and white. Same thing with this hand. I am going to get rid of the red and change the yellow to white. This one I'm going to change, it should be white. We know that the buttons on Mickey is white, but because this is all the same color, it will look better in black. Oh, sorry, I'm working on the to the pants. So I want to change this to black. Okay? 
Same thing with this. I think that the red should be black. You can make it any color you like. Um, that's your choice. But I like the way they look. Okay. Now, what we're going to do is rule of thumb for the big clip for me is I like them to be two and a half tall, maybe a little bit more. So we'll start with the hand. Uh, that's three and a half by three. Um, let's make it three. 3.0. 3 they actually look almost like the same size right now because your width is a three. I like the way that one looks. So this one, we'll go to three and see how it looks. See, that height is just a little too short for me. So I'm going to work on the height versus the width right now. And I like the way that looks. They all look pretty decent, right? And right now this is a three and a half. We'll change the, we'll change the height and see what we look like first. I like the way that looks. Okay, so now we have those four. Remember, we have to now copy, edit, copy, edit, paste. And we want to flip it horizontally. Okay, so then we're going to pair them up. See how when they're mirror image. This way when I print them out and I glue them together, you'll have a front and a back. Right? A front and a back. Okay, so I'm going to do the same thing as before. I'm going to flatten each set. Once I flatten them, We'll be able to print and cut. Now they're done. Don't forget to save your work and now we'll see what it looks like when we go to save uh, print. We'll have three pages of these. My next video will show me printing them out, cutting them, and putting them together. Thanks for watching video number one. I'll see you in a few.